Today we've got some amazing updates and a sneak peek in what's coming 2024, so let's dive right in. Rhino Linux has been working tirelessly on its latest release 2023.4 and is packed with some fantastic enhancements. They introduced the Unicorn desktop auto tiling features, making Windows management a breeze. Plus, U-Launcher has a sleek new look with round edges and a fresh background color. The Rhino PKG has also undergone some major improvements. They revamped the update process so Nala won't automatically remove packages anymore. Now, users can use the new Rhino PKG cleanup command to tidy up their system, removing unnecessary packages and fixing broken dependencies. And let's talk Pine64. They rolled out stability fixes for the PinePhone and PinePhone Pro modem, along with enabling GPS support. The Pine Tab 2 now features a more user-friendly experimental Wi-Fi module, and guess what? Flashlight support is now available on all Pine phones and Pine Tabs, inspired by Orion Cloudforce Ubuntu Touch Port. They also added some nifty new features across the board. Your system app now shows the version number as a clickable pill for easy copying. Plus, they introduced Packstyle QA, a tool to test pass scripts locally, and announced the Unicorn Beyond XFCE initiative to bring Unicorn to other desktop environments. Oh, and for the techies out there, the installed kernel for this release includes 6.6.7 generic for desktop, 6.7.0 on Pine64 devices, and 6.5.0 for Raspberry Pi. They also squashed pesky bugs like resolving Bluetooth issues during the transition from Pulse Audio to Pipeware and fixing the Your System app stuck in light mode. In 2024, get ready for a brand new icon pack. They've been hard at work designing a visually appealing pack that still captures the original artwork's essence. And remember the Unicorn Beyond XFC initiative? Well, they're diving deeper into UBXI port this year. They're making big moves with Rhino PKG 2. It's getting a complete rewrite in a nutshell, aiming for faster speeds, accuracy and exciting new functions like singing repositories without upgrading and displaying descriptions in search results. Packstall 5.0 is also on the horizon bringing us closer to PKG builds capabilities. And guess what? They're exploring the possibility of Rhino Linux switching to Wayland for improved performance. While they're at it, they're working on offline installation support and beefing up Rhino Linux wiki with better documentation. That's a wrap folks, we're super excited about what's coming up for Rhino Linux in 2024 and we hope you are too. And as always, if you enjoyed this video, please like, share and subscribe.